Hello, welcome to Destined to Win tutorial. This is the third part of geometric progression. If you notice, uh, I've cut the video to one question per video. This to make sure the time is uh, between three to five minutes uh, for easy download for students that don't have enough uh, megabytes. So this is the third part. This is part three. So here it says in YAC 2013 theory question 13A, the third term of a geometric progression, that's GP, is 24, and its seventh term is 4 number 20 over 27. Find its first term. Always knowing, please just let this uh, formula be at the back of your mind. As a YX student, let this formula always be at the back of your mind and just write it immediately if you want to start solving that question. So here... It says the third term, that's 3t a r square is equal to 24. That's equation 1. And the seventh term is a r 6 equal to, that's 4 whole number 20 over 27. Changing this to proper fraction, we have what? 27 times 4 will give us 108 plus 20. It will give us 128. Remembering our, our uh, sub uh, treated topic on fractions. 21 to 8 over 27 that's equation 2 so here all we just need to do is divide this equation by this equation so we have a r raised power 6 divided by a r square equal to 1 to 8 over 27 divided by 24 so here let me make this proper. So we have a r raised power 6 to 128 over 27 times 1 over 24. So here a will cancel a. So this will cancel and we are left with r raised power 4. Here um, what will go? We have let's 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 use smaller numbers. Um 4 would go here 6 times, 4 would go here in 32 times, and uh, 2 will go here 3 times, and 2 will go here 16 times. So we have 16, 27 times 3 is 81, 16 over 81. So from here, let's find the fourth root of 16 over 81. So R would be what, remember I changed the subject formula, fourth root. And what's this fourth root? R is equal to what? 2 over 3. Because when you multiply 2 in 4 times, you get 16. And multiply 3 in 4 times, you get 3. And the question says, find the first term. Since we already know R, just, let's just slot it into either one of these equations. So let's pick equation 1. So we have R square equal to 24. We know R as 2 over 3. So A multiplied by 2 over 3 all squared equal to 24. So we have A times... 4 over 9 equal to 24. So A is equal to 24 times 9 over 4. So here 1, here 6. So A is equal to 6 times 9 is 54. It's always good you know your times table by heart. Thank you for staying tuned to Destined to Win Tutorials. Please like, share, subscribe our video and also leave a comment and uh, tell us which uh, particular topic you want us to treat before your YEC comes up. Thank you.